All right, it's David with Bull Ridge Plumbing. I'm at 1217 Dodge Court. Making a dirty movie down here in the basement bathroom. Currently out 97 feet. And that's as far as I can get. Got a pretty significant offset here. Where they've tied back on to the clay line. And as you can see, hold a bunch of water here as well. Um, we're going to be holding water for quite a while. Pretty much the whole length of this plastic is underwater. Um, so, yeah, it's definitely not a good thing here. Because obviously if we're holding water, means we can be holding solids as well. Which means we're probably going to need more frequent maintenance on the line. here. <laughs> I can't get that to cooperate with me a little bit. There, hold that. All right, anyway. And right there, we start popping out of the water. Looks to me this has been backing up quite a bit. I mean, you can see by all the uh, sludge and stuff on the top of the pipe. We've had some issues with this ongoing. All right, here we're going to transition from that plastic into the original clay piping. Let's see, we've got a rubber coupling on this. It is offset a bit. And got a bit of root growth in here. Anything too terrible though. I um, don't know that we necessarily need to go clean as far as the roots go. Uh, I am going to recommend we do a root X on this though. Uh, my usual disclaimer I am going to take this back to the shop, look at it on the bigger screen before I make any recommendations, determinations, anything like that. Just roots there. And I believe right there's a transition at the edge of the house, maybe, possibly. Can't really see though because. Again, underwater. No, still in the clay. Got some roots there. And there we've transitioned underneath the house into the cast iron pipe. shower there. Again, David with Boris Plumbing on Dodge Court. Thank you.